Good evening, everyone. Hello and welcome back to Portman Road for another midweek match day as the Tigers come to town. Entering this one unbeaten in seven, tonight Ipswich face a whole City team equally capable and equally tough to beat. There's a searching ball from Davis and Chaplin will leave it for Wes Burns. Burns coming onto it right hand side just outside the whole penalty area. That's magnificent. That is brilliant for Burns. Just over five minutes gone. And Wes Burns scores his first goal of the season. The first time he's been on the score sheet since that famous afternoon against Exeter back in April. What a marvellous hit from Wes Burns. Ipswich win it back high up the field with George Hurst. Davis on the overlap. Hurst slides Davis in. Davis across goal and Harness can't quite reach it. We'll drive one out to Wes Burns on the right hand side and Burns will deliver an early towards George Hurst and Hurst was under pressure. Turns away from Tyler Morton, looks to cross in towards George Hurst. And it's Jean Michael Seri looking to play it forward to the run of Liam De Lapp, right hand side. The lap away from Edmonds, and is he? No, that's terrific defending, not quite. Connolly almost squeaks it home. Morsi will switch the ball towards Leif Davis on the left hand side. Davis faced up by Cyrus Christie. Here's Marcus Harness inside the penalty area, onto his right foot. Brilliant from Harness, saved by Allsop. Leif Davis, left-hand side from Ipswich Town, feeds Connor Chaplin 35 yards out. Chaplin twisting and turning away from a couple of amber shirts and then Harness with the effort. Christie, Tyler Morton in space here and he tries to play it to his left-hand side, doesn't quite drop for Connolly, now drops for Philogene inside the penalty area. Wolfman and Williams doing terrifically, brilliant, brilliant defending. Philogene plays it inside but it's Straight to Massimo Luongo, here's Wes Burns. He delivers in from right by the near touchline. Luongo, but for the effort, just wide. Back to Hladke, Hladke has to be careful here. Well played. And in Westlake and the watching on Blue Army enjoyed that composed piece of play from Václav Hladke. Now it's with Marcus Harness. And now it's Leif Davis left hand side. Hurst getting up in support. Drops with Connor Chaplin inside the D. Left for the corner! Connor Chaplin! With a goal! That's come from back to front yet again! Gladke receives a hug from Edmondson down the other end of the field. A goal that oozes class and quality. And it puts it through town tuning up. Chaplin skips over and it runs for Burns. Right hand side faced up by Coyle. Harness flicks it back for Chaplin. And it's taken the deflection, it's out for a corner. Gautier in the lap cuts it back for Aaron Connolly. And then Wolfenden, I think just did enough at the feet of Aaron Connolly. But if you break through that, the reward's massive because you're sort of... It's a long ball from Hadke here that's found Hurst. Hurst inside the penalty area now, left hand side, trying to cut it back for Harness! And how he deserves that! Marcus Harness! He's made some terrific contributions in recent weeks. He was the provider here last week. And now he gets himself amongst the goals. Ipswich Town 3, Carl City 0. Your old centre back. Oh, he's looking long for the run of George Hurst. If Hurst can bring this down, he might be in. Christie did enough, but Hurst is back to his feet quicker. It's George Hurst, and it's blocked by McLaughlin. It's been absolutely fantastic for him. I think the goal at the weekend has given his confidence. Here's Hutchinson breaking into the penalty area. Is he fouled by Sinnott? And the referee has a decision to make. Play goes on. The lap, he'll hit another one and Ladke tested again. But again, Ladke equal to it. There we go. Ipswich Town win again at Portland Road. And at the moment, you come to this stadium in Suffolk expecting goals and expecting wins.
The football tonight at times has been majestic. Full time here at Portman Road. It's finished. Ipswich Town 3, Hull City 0.